In today's video, we're venturing on an intriguing journey to uncover six peculiar signs and symptoms of liver damage. While many associate liver issues solely with excessive alcohol consumption, the truth is far more complex. Welcome back to the Longevity Deprocessed channel. Liver damage can stem from various factors, including dietary habits, lifestyle alterations, and the presence of a fatty liver, and more. Unfortunately, the onset of liver damage often goes unnoticed until it reaches an advanced stage, necessitating intensive treatment or even surgical intervention. To avert such dire circumstances, it's imperative to familiarize ourselves with the subtle yet telling signs and symptoms of liver damage, as early detection can make all the difference in preventing significant health complications down the line. Sign number one. Let's traverse into a fascinating symptom. Weird. The yellowing of the skin and eyes, also known as jaundice. Now, I know it might sound a bit odd, but trust me, it's crucial to take note of. You see, our liver is like a superhero, timelessly processing a substance called bilirubin, which gives off that yellow hue. But when our liver isn't up to par, bilirubin can accumulate, resulting in that noticeable yellow tint in our skin and eyes. Now let's break it down a bit further. Bilirubin is a natural byproduct of old red blood cell breakdown. Ordinarily, our liver swoops in to process and eliminate it through bile. But if our liver is struggling, bilirubin can't be handled properly, causing it to build up and manifest that distinct yellow color. In medical terms, jaundice is identified by heightened bilirubin levels in the blood. It's essential to grasp that jaundice isn't a standalone condition, but rather a red flag for an underlying liver issue. So if you catch a glimpse of your skin or eyes taking on a golden hue, it's a clear sign that your liver might need some attention. And seeking medical guidance promptly is a wise move. Remember, Early detection can be a game changer in the realm of liver health management. By the way, jaundice is also a sign of pancreatic cancer. Next up, sign number two. All right, let's probe into something we've all dealt with, that overwhelming sense of exhaustion and unrelenting fatigue. But when it comes to liver health, this tiredness takes on a whole new dimension and it's often baffling. Oh, a quick favor we'd greatly appreciate it. If you could subscribe and like, this helps the YouTube algorithm recognize the value of our content and share it more widely. Picture this, feeling like you're constantly running on empty, no matter how many Zs you catch. This relentless fatigue might just be your body's way of signaling that your liver isn't firing on all cylinders. Weird. Here's the scoop. Our liver acts like a storage unit for a type of sugar called glycogen, which our body taps into for energy boost. But when the liver's in rough shape, it struggles to release glycogen effectively, leaving us feeling perpetually drained. From a clinical standpoint, this fatigue is often accompanied by elevated liver enzymes and a dip in the liver's protein-producing prowlness. So if you're stuck in an energy slump that won't budge, it could be your body's subtle plea to give your liver some TLC. Don't brush off this warning sign. Catching it early could be the ticket to safeguarding your overall wellness. If you're nodding along with this fatigue struggle, it might be time to chat with a healthcare pro and delve deeper into what's brewing beneath the surface. Moving on, sign number three. Let's address our next peculiar symptom, the infamous itching that refuses to relent. Weird. While we've all experienced the occasional scratch, when that itch becomes an incessant annoyance, it could signify more than mere dry skin. Our liver, a pivotal player in skin health, may falter in its function, leading to an accumulation of bothersome bile salts in our bloodstream. This buildup is to blame for the never-ending itch. Here's the lowdown. Bile salts, meticulously produced by the liver for digestion assistance, 
can unmask and infiltrate the skin when our liver function is compromised. Elevated levels of these salts in the bloodstream are often indicative of liver-related issues. So if you find yourself trapped in an itch fest with no relief in sight, it may be your liver raising a red flag. Although itchy skin might seem inconsequential, it serves as a subtle indicator of potential internal irregularities. Rather than dismissing the itch, consider seeking guidance from a healthcare professional to dig into the root cause and potentially nip any liver concerns in the bud. Taking early action can significantly impact the management of these conditions and prevent further complications. Moving forward, sign number four. Now let's uncover our next intriguing clue, dark urine. Weird. While it may seem odd to fixate on the color of your pee, it's actually a key indicator of your liver's well-being. Under normal circumstances, urine sports a pale yellow hue. But if you find it taking on a darker shade, it could be your body's way of signaling liver trouble. Dark urine hints at possible difficulties in your liver's processing of bilirubin. Consider it a subtle cautionary signal. While it's not necessarily cause for alarm, it's definitely a clue to sit up and take notice. If dark urine becomes a consistent presence, it's wise to seek guidance from a healthcare pro. They can dive deeper into the issue, pinpointing any potential liver-related concerns before they escalate. Remember, early intervention is the cornerstone of good health. Next up, sign number five. Let's move on to our next thought-provoking sign. Pale or clay-colored stools. Weird. While it's not exactly a dinner table conversation, the hue of your stool holds vital clues about your liver's condition. Typically, stools flaunt their brown hue thanks to bilirubin, a liver-produced substance. When the liver is firing on all cylinders, it processes bilirubin, lending that characteristic color to your bowel movements. But if the liver hits a snag, bilirubin processing may falter, resulting in pale or clay-colored stools. In essence, these light stools suggest a hiccup in the usual coloration process. Consider it a visual signal that your body's internal workings may be off kilter. Clinically, this color shift indicates a drop in bilirubin levels in the stool, hinting at potential liver hiccups. While it's not the most glamorous topic, Keeping an eye on stool color changes can serve as an early warning of liver woes. If pale stools persist, it's wise to confer with a healthcare pro to scrutinize your liver function and address any underlying issues. Early action can be a game changer for your overall health and vitality. Next up, sign number six. Let's explore into our next compelling sign, bruising easily. While a bruise here and there is par for the course, an uptick in bruising could be telling of your liver status. Weird. You see, the liver churns out proteins crucial for blood clotting. When liver function falters, so does its ability to produce these proteins, paving the way for easier bruising. Picture it like this. The liver's proteins act as the body's internal repair squad swooping in to staunch bleeding and men bruises. But if the liver function takes a hit, this repair crew may be shorthanded, leaving you more prone to bruises. Clinically, this heightened bruising tendency is tied to a drop in clotting factors churned out by the liver. So if you're sporting more bruising than usual, especially from minor bumps, it's wise to touch base with a healthcare pro they can evaluate your liver function and offer insights on addressing any potential issues. Recognizing the signs of liver damage is crucial for early detection and intervention. From yellowing skin to unexplained fatigue and from dark urine to easy bruising, these symptoms serve as valuable indicators of potential liver issues. By staying vigilant and seeking medical attention promptly when these signs arise, 
individuals can take proactive steps to safeguard their liver health and overall well-being. Remember, early detection is key, so don't hesitate to consult with a healthcare professional if you notice any concerning symptoms.